Thank you, I, we will. <laughs> I think it's safe to say that the electricity in this room tonight could power the university for the next several days. <laughs> 45 years ago, this weekend, Joanne and I were celebrating our junior weekend. You are Norwich's bicentennial class. I bet that you've heard that ever since you applied here and prominent and it's obviously prominently displayed on your ring design that I've seen in the in the program for tonight. I doubt it had anything to do with your matriculating here. I doubt it helped you make the decision to come here at all, despite what admissions would like you to believe. But in all seriousness, you'll carry that idea or that concept of being the bicentennial class with you into the future. There's only one, you're it. And so carry that distinction with pride and with some humility. No one can take that from you, no one. So do it with justice, as I'm sure you will. And someday, like us, you'll be traveling down the uh, New York State Thruway and uh, a car will pull up on the side of you. And that car, they'll start blasting the horn at you. And you'll think your car is falling apart or that you've got some kind of a problem. Lo and behold, the car pulls in front of you, and what do you see but a Norwich sticker in the rear window, and then you stop on the side of the interstate to have a conversation with someone you've never met before. So there's something really powerful about this Norwich experience. Because of this Norwich experience, because of what you've done over the last three years, because of what you will do in your future, you are a special part of the Norwich family. If each of you does one thing, volunteer at whatever, that helps some organization, wherever that may be, whether it's the Boy Scouts, the Little League, or the Senior Citizen Center, I don't care where, find a place that you can connect with and help them. Think about the world being a better place to be. None of us can do it all, but all of us can do something.